Good morning, welcome back to my vlog. I haven't vlogged in like a month. I don't know why, I think I just um, fell out of the routine of it. But um, it's Monday morning, it is 11 o'clock. I am exhausted after the last week. So last week was Paddy's day and I'm sure a lot of you can relate that a midweek mid Paddy's day kind of messes up your week. Uh, I wasn't in the best of routines. Like I still was exercising and stuff, but I just feel like I did not get enough sleep the last week. I didn't keep up with my usual like self-care routine, which I know sounds silly and it sounds like a buzzword almost, but I do find an, a difference in like my mood and my energy when I don't take the time to like um, write in my gratitude journal and eat well and sleep enough and all that kind of stuff. Um, so I started today, I like cleaned my sheets, I went for a 7k run which was really really tough. Um, in the summer I used to do it twice a week and I used to do it in 35 minutes, I'd be flying it and I'm not, not there at all yet. But I'm gonna get back there. I just need kind of like a few healthy weekends. And I don't know about you, but in lockdown, I just find that hard. Like I find like I have the best of intentions and come Friday, I'm like, pass the wine, pass the takeaways. But um, yeah, I'm not being hard myself about it. I have been having a great time the last couple of months. If you follow me on Instagram, you might have seen that I said on my stories there last week that I'm in a relationship now, which has been really, really nice. Um, yeah, I'm gonna keep it offline though, uh, but it's really, I'm really happy. I, I can't remember the last time I was this happy, so yeah. Um, anyway, I'm gonna go and do some groceries now and then I am gonna get stuck into work. I've done a little bit this morning, I did like emails and stuff, but I just needed to start the day right, get some exercise in, shower, organize myself, um, fill the food, the fridge up with like healthy food and then I will get stuck into like recording stuff. Uh, I don't know why I always leave stuff to be recorded on Monday because I'm usually like... <laughs> but yeah, you probably can, can you imagine like anyone watching this who doesn't have to do this for their job? Can you imagine coming on on a Monday morning and having to like record and talk to camera and be like full of energy and looking not tired and I'm just like... Will that ever be me? I don't know. <laughs> but uh, yeah, uh, I'm gonna go and get something to eat because I'm starving and fill up the fridge and then I will check back in with you after. So I got some diluted because I crave sugary drinks all the time. Some toilet stuff. Six bottles of sparkling water because that's another addiction of mine. This is the dinner. Rocket, tomato, spring onion, broccoli, and asparagus. So that's for tonight's dinner. Um, snacks, uh, rice cakes, almond butter, and raspberries. These used to be my, my snacks when I lived in America and I also got some yogurts. Strawberry and raspberry and I also got these to snack on because it's good for like protein. Just uh, cold cut chicken and strawberries. And I got some, this one I have for lunch. Bacon medallions, eggs, mushrooms, and tin foil and my bread. Okay, so I'm just about to head out to take a picture. I was gonna have to take on my tripod, but Megan is gonna help me. Megan, come and show my vlog your outfit today. Oh yeah. She got all glam for her work call. For a Zoom call, and it feels good to dress up. I love the necklace and the earrings and the hair. I feel like my mom would be very surprised because she loves when I wear accessories. <laughs> I need more accessories, guys. Look at the state of my room. I know, but you should have it kitted out soon enough. I know, oh my god, it's so messy. So I just recorded some work. I'm sitting here in front of my ring light, which is probably why I look a little bit more alive than earlier. But I got through with the work that I needed. I got it sent off, the ones that were due today. So that's good. Um, I'm gonna do some work for my book club now on Wednesday. We're reading Where the Crawdads Sing. I will link my book club Instagram here in case you're interested in joining. The next book we're gonna read is Acts of Desperation. 
and I just I, I've been loving it like it's I've been doing it now since October so six months and we have just such a nice community of people and we've been reading really good books and get really good like conversations going so I'm really excited I'm looking forward to it now on Wednesday um but what else oh yeah it's 18th birthday today so I'm gonna organize to have something sent to her house we've actually Megan's birthday here on Friday so I was ordering some stuff for that too gotta do that now as well and then I'm gonna head out um gotta get some more bits in the grocery shop um yeah so I feel like good it's always that way on a Monday I start off and I'm like I don't have enough time to get through my to-do list today but I'm I'm making my way through it at like a good pace so I'm happy I think it's time for another coffee <laughs> this is today's outfit it's a shacket I broke out the white jeans they're the Dr. Denim ones and the top is a t-shirt it's a Sinead Peary an Irish designer but I'll link the, the jacket, it's from ASOS, and if I can link the other bits, I will. Just out for a walk, and look what I got! The ultimate treat. And I'm gonna go home now and cook dinner, and do a workout. Look at this tree. It's yeah. cherry blossom season. Except that's the only one. So this is dinner tonight. I made it for Megan and I. So we've got salmon that was roasted in the oven with the asparagus and broccoli and I seasoned those and we have underneath rocket, spring onion, tomato, a little bit of balsamic on that and then two boiled eggs. How good does that look? So good. Yum. Your week is not off to a good start when you don't have socks to wear because you have been too busy or too not busy at the weekend to do it. So, to do your washing. So I did it, and tomorrow we're gonna pretend it's a Monday and we're gonna start the week all over again. There's just no good lighting when you're this tired. Um, I spent the last couple of hours cleaned up after dinner and then did my laundry and sat down and watched some Married at First Sight, but I didn't really watch much of it because I had stuff, stuff to do on my phone. I was organizing my best friend's baby shower, uh, her virtual one. So just ordering bits and pieces for that. Um, ordering birthday presents and what else did I do? Something, I spent money on something else but I can't remember what it was. Um, and now I need to sit down and plan. Like I have loads of stuff due this week and I got kind of stressed a while ago I think because so much of it involves so many different ideas and like I'm running out of ideas. Uh, just while I'm at home, shooting at home by myself. I'm like limited in what I can do. Even though I'm not, it's just it takes a lot of time to like find these ideas and I always want to give everything like 100%. So I'm gonna spend a bit of time tonight doing that and then tomorrow I will prep for the book club because I didn't do that today. Um, but yeah, it's good to be busy and we had a really like healthy day today. I feel like somewhat back on track. Um, so it's good. Tomorrow I'll be less tired. I'm gonna get up early and go for a run and That's it Good morning. I did not go for my run this morning I said I would start the day on a nice note went for a walk and a coffee uh, It's actually a really nice like fresh morning in my comfy clothes, but I'm gonna get changed now get ready to shoot stuff so time for the transformation <laughs> doing my hair in the kitchen. I need to get a set up in my room for doing my hair, but um, I'm having furniture made and it's just taking a little bit longer than planned. So I'll have like a desk and kind of like a vanity area when I have that ready. So hopefully, hopefully soon. So I'm just using the steam pod as usual. Um, Doing my like apple blow dry look. Okay, this is my hair after. I absolutely love 
the way my hair looks when I use the steam pod. I'm an ambassador for them for the year and full disclosure that this is not a part of what I'm being paid to do for them. Um, but like obviously as an amb I'm an ambassador it's naturally going to feature in my content um, and I just love it. I love the kind of, I don't know, it just looks so bouncy and fresh when I use it. So I'm going to put some serum in it now and then get dressed and get ready to shoot. Okay, I'm just finished shooting. It took me like an hour and a half to shoot it, then editing as well. And I have to do the stories and stuff, but I'll just show you. And I'll have to turn off the volume because it will stay copyrighted. You should have seen me trying to get the lift one. So funny, I'll actually show you. Behind the scenes. Oh, is this it? Nope. <laughs> Lol. I attempt to make this coffee. I kind of get sick of an espresso coffee every now and then. So I presume we put the water in here, coffee in here, and that's it. <laughs> we'll see. You know what? That's not how you do it. I reckon you put the cup. Yeah, no, that's definitely not how you do it. Fuck. Ah! I got it working, but then I forgot about it. So, we have burnt coffee. <laughs> okay, I've drank my cup of burnt coffee, and it was actually really good. Me and Megan are gonna go down for a run now, like an interval run, and then we're gonna have lunch. And then, more work, more shooting. So the aim of the game was to run, but to not get my hair too sweaty that I can't shoot anything else for the rest of the day. How are you feeling for our run, Megan? I can't wait. <laughs> it's energy all of a sudden, so I just want to get it done. And you didn't even have any of my burnt coffee. <laughs> Coop, no. Barky Coop. Hey, I'm in the kitchen. Hello. Red lipstick on, I was busy shooting all day. I did, got another video done and I'm actually really happy with it so I'm delighted. And I was wrecked after the run as well. So just been, have been like shooting and editing and that's basically it. So now I'm gonna make dinner and then I'm hopefully gonna get another workout in. She looks lovely out. Maybe I'll bring Coop for a walk or else I'll get some use out of the spin bike. Um, but we're, I'm gonna make some meat song for dinner, like the healthy kind. Uh, if you follow my vlogs, you'll see. It seems like we make it a lot, but usually it's just like early on in the week because it's quite light and healthy. Um, and then chill for the evening. I feel like I'm gonna be wrecked after all the working out. Um, I've also got Pilates tonight at seven in an hour, so yeah. Dinner is ready, nice and healthy and quick. Walk time. Isn't that coop? Is it? <laughs> okay, it is seven o'clock and it is Pilates time. I'm gonna show you where I log in. Bar Pilates on a Tuesday. Um, it's just about to start, but I'm gonna put down the blinds because nobody needs to see this. Don't they not coop? I'm even whipping out the ankle weights tonight. We're committed to the cause tonight. It's happening! My weights, where are they? Oh, she's on. Here she is. I'm gonna grab some water. Whew. I'm like getting loads done today. Do you know those productive days? I love it. I am gonna spend the night now getting ready for book club. And then I will feel like I've finally caught up with my week. Is it bad that I'm doing Pilates and looking over at Cooper on the couch thinking what a life he has. I'm so jealous. <laughs> oh, the struggle. Oh. oh my god, my legs are burning. Okay, this day is just getting more and more exciting. Now it's rubbish time. See this? This is all recycling that we have to bring down. But it's too big for one person, so we both have to go. And then, get organized for book club, and that's basically my day. It's like eight o'clock. 
shower and get into bed and do book club stuff and that's it up for in the morning for a hit session actually i have to text the guy i'm doing on zoom with to see if he can include the bike because we got the bike and we gotta use it now i am in bed it's time to get ready for book club tomorrow i'm gonna just spend some time writing up some questions and just getting organized we be finishing off the book for tomorrow so i'm looking forward to that it's such a good book and i have my pal here keep me company and i got some face masks to try out too it's so funny it comes with two masks one and two, I've seen these before, so you can see that one must go on the whole face and then that one just goes on your chin. They go on at the same time, okay. Interesting, give it a go. Good morning, it's Wednesday and it's seven. I'm about to go for a run and I've got my hit workout at eight. It's like really so near, so I'm very ambitious today. I'm wearing my night gear. These leggings are, I got them like September and the top as well. I'll try and find something similar and link them. Okay, back from the little warm-up run and I think I pulled my knee and now we're about to start a little hit workout with Connor. Hi Connor. Hi. I'm just vlogging so if you want to say hi to my oh, camera. Nice. <laughs> workout done. Um, I'll put in what we did and now I'm gonna put a treatment in my hair for a few minutes and I'm gonna do the dishwasher and listen to Justin Bieber's new album. I'm using the old plex um, Number three, hair perfecta. It is supposed to look really good for repairing hair. This is literally the very end of this. I will link this in the description too. It's a life changing for hair. I feel like the lime in the water, I feel like that's what I've been told anyway. It's kind of making my hair really dry. What I would do for a trip to the hairdressers. Oh my God. Okay, I'm about to record like a makeup collaboration so I am going to dye my brows first with one of the products I've used it before and it's brilliant but I got dark brown the last time and this is black so I think like my brows are actually like quite dark but I really need it done as you can see wow this is not a good look <laughs> yeah, I'm making the yummiest omelette for lunch it's got Two full eggs, one egg white, um, chicken, enjua, which is this stuff, it's like kind of chorizo, red onion, tomatoes, and mushrooms. And then I've got a side salad over here as well, which is just kind of leftovers of the veg with a little bit of balsamic on it. Not bad. So yum. Some water from here too. And then sit down and eat this. Now I'm gonna put on some false nails so that when I'm doing my video, my nails look good. Oops. I will link these below. Can we take a second just to appreciate my nails or my fake nails? I haven't worn fake nails since I was like a teenager, but I just miss having them look nice and it's, I'm doing a beauty video now, so at least they'll look good, you know? Yay! I'm just finished recording this makeup look. Um, of course, I miss all the good bits when I'm vlogging. I forget because I'm doing so many different things, but I do this like squirty foundation thing. Look at my top. And it's all over my shorts as well. So I've changed top to record the stories, but I'll show you. I'll put in the video because it's actually kind of cool the way it came out. Don't tell me you go off for me, spend some time with me. Say you try and be my everything, and that's fine with me. I ain't never gonna lie to you, so don't you lie to me. Know that you got my heart if you just treat it properly. Cause I ain't never. But uh, I'm gonna have to put this straight in the wash. I feel like it's ruined. It's kind of wrecked anyway. It's just a Zara bodysuit. Um. I need to buy a new one anyway, but I feel like this might seal the deal. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna finish the stories for that. And then I have a call. Um, I am involved with UNICEF this year. I'm like on their board and we're organizing a girls night, like a virtual event and I'm hosting it and as well as like helping organize. So we've had like to try and sell tickets and get sponsors on board and just organize everything. So I have a call at, at two and I'm running late um, for that. I'm just try to finish my stories first and then uh, we're just going to try and figure out what we'll talk to like the different panelists about and then after that I have to record some more 
um, content, some stories. Ooh, doesn't look good in this light. But... Okay, hi. Uh, you can tell that was the one I was brushing into the camera on. It's strong. Um, also, that my brows look good. This is them with a bit of tinting on them. Wow, the difference makeup makes. I'm so sorry I made you look at me all morning with no makeup on. I should at least put on like something. Anyway, um, Megan just gone out for a coffee. I was supposed to go, but I have to shoot more stuff. And then honestly, I think once today is over, I'll feel so much better. So I'm gonna have a quick snack and um, fire through the last of my work. And I, I think I'll have a weight lifted off my shoulders then. Yum. Guess what? Still not full. So I'm gonna have a Muller light yogurt and strawberry. Yum. Today has been so long. It's now 20 to 5 and I'm still not done. But I'm nearly done. I am drinking a coffee that Megan got me from up the road, one of our favorite coffee shops, and I'm procrastinating for a second and I'm making a quick online order from Zara because I saw a reel that I need all the clothes from. You know how it is. Okay, I'm gonna plan what I have to shoot tomorrow. And then I think I'm nearly done. I'm gonna head out for dinner and get takeaway just because I need to get out of the house productive day okay we're done finally oh what a long day it's a uh, half five my eyes are blurry from staring at screens i'm gonna go um for a walk with coop i gotta go to the pharmacy and then dinner soon um and i got to get something in sprout and then i've got book club at eight and yeah then it's nearly the weekend so yay we made it to wednesday So I usually turn off my camera once I've set up because people start to join. I wonder how many we'll have tonight. Look at Coop, he's so comfy. Okay, we have 48 people on already and we have another two minutes to go. So looks like there's gonna be a good turnout this week. Oh, what happened? There we go. And the, the bus was like the late, so. Book club's done. Um, it was really good. There was like 150 people on this week. Um, definitely got the sense that people were a little bit tired this week. I think lockdown is getting to people, believe it or not, after all this time. Um, I'm just having a snack and I'm trying so hard to be healthy. It's come easier other days this week than today. Having apple and I have some almond butter with it. And I'm having like diluted and fizzy water. And Megan's having a margarita and I'm so jealous. Down right now. <laughs> it's her birthday week, she yeah. has to. And I'm dying. It'd be rude not to on your birthday week. Um, it's sad that I don't have my margarita friend. I know, I'm not letting the team down, but last week was Paddy's week and it was a big week, so I just need to get my energy back and then I'll be grand. Um, oh, Megan closed all of her activity rings. <laughs> and we're gonna watch Married at First Sight and then I'm gonna head to bed early because I'm absolutely wrecked after today. So yeah, that's it. Good morning, it is Thursday, it's five to nine. I got up a bit later today, um, I had such a good sleep. Uh, but I did wake up, not to be negative, but I did wake up with a bit of like, oh my God, we're still in lockdown. I think it's hitting everyone this week, just how long it's actually going on. And like, we haven't heard from the government in like weeks. 
so april 5th which is next week i think we get an update but like we just are in it longer than other countries you know hopefully like and it's just like hard because it just doesn't seem to be working like the numbers are still really high and uh, i think people are definitely starting to lose hope god i would love to have just something to look forward to it's mad to think it's a year since i was like walking through an empty times square with coop um i'm gonna have my vitamins now and i'm gonna make a coffee oh actually look my brows look way better today they were a bit too dark yesterday um and i also have no makeup on right now so please no judgment i will look well later <laughs> i'm starting my new book today megan nolan acts of desperation and i'm gonna just sit down for like 20 minutes and do that because it used to be my morning routine to do that every day but i've just gotten out of that habit um and then i'm gonna take cooper for a walk and then maybe around half 10 i'll start shooting so yeah Okay, walk time. I'm wearing my Annie Bing jumper and my Puma leggings and these runners, they're my Nike Quests. I'll actually link them, they're so comfy. I wear them just for running and walking. You ready to go, Coop? Are you excited? Ooh. Okay, I'm just back from my walk. Look at Cooper's toys, like everywhere. And I just did my hair using the steam pot again. I'm going to do a makeup now and then shoot a video and then have lunch. Hey, sorry, I've been in my own morning. It's one o'clock now and I was shooting there for the last few hours and I'm just having my lunch. I'm having bacon, eggs, poached eggs, mushrooms and toast and sparkling water. I will show you, oh, actually I can't show you because I can't show you what I'm shooting because it doesn't go up till Monday. And then after I have to shoot more stuff, I have another, I don't know, I gotta decide what I'm gonna do for this, it's like a fashion one, so I think I might do a picture for a change because I've been doing a lot of videos, so I'm just gonna think what way I'll do it, come up with some ideas. Okay, another video shot. Now I am gonna unpack all these boxes and see what's in them, and then I'm gonna edit and videos and get them ready, and then possibly spin class it is now quarter to three oh my god the day's flying by but i feel like after today i'll have done like most of the hard work for the week yay okay the first thing i got is megan's birthday present i got her this candle it's the scent of a dare manner which she loves and she loves a white shirt so i got her this and i also got her I also got these t-shirts, I got it in black and in white. It's got this string that kind of ties around the middle. And how much was that? That was, what does it say? They were cheap though, they were like maybe 10 and 20. And then I got this um, cardigan, which I love the color of and I love the fit, the kind of thick knit. That's the same t-shirt in white. And then I got this denim skirt. Oh no, this is dangerous. From Lily O'Brien, this is a press wrap. God, creamy caramel sea salt. Oh, I really love her, it's mind. I need to see. Oh, yum. Okay, these are new too. This is like a mint jumpsuit, one shoulder jumpsuit. I really should try it on, but if I, I've already changed my efforts like a million times today. Maybe I will do a try on haul soon. And I got this like knit full length dress. I love the collar on that. I'm pretty lavish i'll link everything below and then this gorgeous shirt okay i got this from karen millen it's kind of like a silk t-shirt and then full length navy trousers i think that's gonna be a really cute outfit with like gold jewelry maybe like my hair up and a nice pair of earrings then i got this white knit jumper kind of cream knit jumper from karen millen too and this skirt how cute is that i'll link everything below in the description okay i'm just catching up on emails um it's like four now and the work keeps coming in you know i'm like on a roll that i'm like should i just get it done but then i'm like trying to gauge when everything is due so that i'm not just rushing things do you know what i mean um i would love to get a spin class in so i'm gonna try and finish up here on the computer in the next 15 minutes but before i do a spin i need to know if i need to shoot anything else because i won't get much done if i have sweaty hair do you know that kind of way like once the, once the sweat happens it's there's no coming back so yeah <laughs> okay i'm going out to do some spinning 
I was like all day hoping I'd have time and then when I actually had time, I started procrastinating. I had the bike out here in the balcony. I'm gonna do 30 minute class, I think, cause um, it's been a busy week. <laughs> so yeah, here it goes nothing. It's been done, 30 minutes and 300 calories burned. And now I'm gonna order my takeaway. I'm ordering a takeaway to go on chats with Dorota, so I'm very excited for that. Poor little Coop. He just follows us around all day. Want some dinner? Come on. <laughs> you know the drill. <laughs> I'm gonna get you more water too, Coop. Yay, dinner's here. Camille having chicken and rice and I'm about to load up my, my chat with her now. Okay, Pilates time. It's just about to start. Megan is here too. Coop is here starting already. <laughs> he always <laughs> Getting it done. Especially I'm so jealous of Coop again. <laughs> <laughs> done, another workout. Um, I was thinking I might end the vlog here, but it is Megan's birthday tomorrow, so I might. Uh, vlog a little bit of that and yeah okay I'm probably gonna end it here for tonight I'm gonna go shower I gotta finish off some work oh no you're losing me talk to you tomorrow <laughs> okay so um, I'm so sorry it's like literally nearly five o'clock no, sorry ten past four and I still haven't vlogged today after all my intentions of keeping the vlog going just had a crazy morning um, yeah I was out exercising and work and everything so I um I've just gotten all my stuff together for Megan's birthday I got her this bottle of Moet because she we love Moet but she loves it especially um so I got her a cool one a gift set with a bottle stopper I got her a card she loves a white shirt so I got her this book of all the different ways you can wear white shirts the head plan diary I got her the Adair Manor candle scent and these gorgeous strawberries from um from Italy with love how cute they say happy birthday Meg and I also um I have somebody picking up Megan's birthday cake as well and I got these decorations that's fallen down. I'm just running around today trying to catch up. Um, but yeah, we're getting there and I'm just so excited to have a nice night with her. Uh, okay, <laughs> speaking of which, this is totally not how I had planned on ending the vlog, but I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to end it here for today. I will be back next week. I promise I'll get back into vlogging and I will share some stuff in my stories of what we get up to over the weekend and just celebrating Megan because it's nice to make a fuss especially in lockdown when you know you can't like she can't be around her family and she didn't have a 30th birthday and now it's her 31st birthday so I just wanted to make a fuss for her. Thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed and I will see you next week guys. Bye!